Golden Helix is the software company that developed Genome Browse. Search for Golden Helix and click on Genome Browse. Download Genome Browse. Genome Browse is intended for research and education use only. Move the file to your desktop and double click on the DMG icon. Drag the Genome Browse icon into the Applications folder. Move the DMG and installer files into the trash. Use the Finder to locate the Genome Browse application. Drag the Genome Browse application icon to the dock. Close the Applications window. Double-click on the Genome Browse icon to launch the application. Genome Browse was developed by a trusted source. Click on Open. You will need to register with Golden Helix to use Genome Browse. To register, use the links on the launch page. After registering, log in with your email and password. Let's call the new project, More Family. 23andMe. GRCH37 is the Genome Reference Consortium's Human Genome Build 37. GRCH37 is not from one individual's genome sequence, but is built from reference sequences of different individuals. Although Build 38 is the current standard reference assembly sequence, Build 37 is still used by many testing services and researchers. Genome Browse opens with a display of RefSeq genes, a collection of nucleotide sequences that code for protein products. In the RefSeq track, gene transcripts are represented in a diagrammatic format. Let's add a track that displays the complete human reference sequence. Click on the Add button found in the upper left corner. You'll find the reference sequence in the Assembly folder, inside the Public Annotations folder. A description of the file is available in the Information window at the bottom. You'll want to download this file to your computer, otherwise, you will experience significant delays during operation. Click the download button. A window will appear that monitors the progress of the file download. When the download is finished, you'll find a copy of the file in the user annotations folder that's inside the local folder. Check the box next to reference sequence GRCH37, then click plot and close. Resize a plot by clicking the grab bar at the bottom of the track and drag up or down to the desired size. 